Hi guys, we're here at the Trader Joe's. I'm so excited. We're gonna shop for some carnivore items today. Come on with me. Okay, we're here at Trader Joe's, so we're gonna see what they have for a carnivore diet. It's gonna be really fun. Come on with us. Here's some good looking snack packs for on the go, salami and cheese, easy peasy. Here we are in the cheese section. They have so many choices, lots of imported cheese. They have grass fed cheddar cheese, all different types of cheeses from sheep and goats. And it's just my favorite to get the goat cheese and the sheep cheese because those are less inflammatory for me. My husband loves this halloumi cheese for grilling on the grill. It's amazing. This is the brie section. Some people call it camembert. My husband loves this cheese so much. I like this grass-fed New Zealand cheddar. And they also have this organic cheddar cheese. And this is the goat milk cheese. And they even have raw milk cheese too. All of these look delicious. This is Manchego sheep cheese from Spain. They have imported Parmesan from Italy. Looks wonderful. They also have one made from just sheep's milk. I'm getting this for sure. Can't wait to try this. My baby's already flirting with girls in the store. Here we are in the butter section. They have cultured butter from France. This looks tasty. They also have a salted butter from New Zealand that's grass fed. Don't ever get this, it is vegan butter. Here we have the creme fraiche and the sour cream, cottage cheese. Just try to get the most full fat version that you can of all of these. Here we have the goat milk yogurt. I'm a big fan of this. I ate a lot of this when I was pregnant. Same thing, get the full fat versions. Here they have a grass fed yogurt. This looks great. Here we have the Carol's pasture raised eggs. You always wanna get your chickens to be on pasture eating bugs and worms. They are not vegetarians. Also egg whites for your protein sparing modified fast bread. Make sure to get wild salmon, not Atlantic salmon. It has a lot more omega-3s. Atlantic salmon just means farmed. So they have this coho salmon. It looks great. It's a good value. They have wild cod. Delicious. Lots of seafood here at Trader Joe's. Haddock and swordfish. That one's pretty high in mercury, so be careful. And mahi-mahi is excellent. Wild fish, very affordable. Tuna, Argentinian wild shrimp are delicious and sweet. I love these. They have jumbo sea scallops and also bay scallop. Make sure to avoid cottonseed oil when coming to canned fish. Lots of bad oils. Also, skipjack tuna has less mercury than albacore tuna, so make sure and get skipjack rather than albacore. They also have bone broth. The problem with bone broth is it has a lot of added veggies, so if you're doing strict carnivore, it's probably not a good idea. Also, histamines can be a problem in bone broth if it's stored for a long time, so be aware of that. Now we're in the smoked fish section. Try to always get wild fish when you can. It is the best option. And look at this, it's just beautiful. It's pricey, but it's so tasty and it's worth it. Here we are in the chicken section. Make sure and get whole chickens to save money. Also the dark meat is usually cheaper. I like to get the organic chicken at Trader Joe's. It's not perfect, but it's the best option that they have. Pastured chicken is the top of the heap when it comes to chicken. They have beef, but I find most of the beef here is very overpriced and all the fat has been cut off. They do have some 
ground beef options that are pretty good ribeyes in a little bag but again it's just a lot for what you get make sure and look at the price per pound because it can be really exorbitant they also have kosher meat they have lamb from new zealand i believe and that can be a good deal sometimes they have pork chops lots of pork make sure and avoid impossible meat because it's in the wrong section they have a lot of lunch meats they're not the cleanest option but if you're in a hurry and you can eat some meat and cheese for lunch and be on your way mention the ground beef ground beef is the best tasting grass-fed as far as i'm concerned and theirs is organic as well you can get the 80 20 they have a lot of 80 20 that's pretty good too I've tried these grass-fed steaks from here, but they're very expensive and there's no fat left on them. So I would probably look somewhere else. Here they have a lot of cured meats. They have hot dogs. I like these hot dogs. They have some chicken sausages. Over to the bacon. They have pork bacon and turkey bacon. Now we're in the frozen section. They have some ground beef that looks pretty tasty. Also some 80-20 bison burgers. These are expensive, but very good. Also, they have some regular burgers that are pre-made. These are great, but you're paying about a dollar more just for them to be formed into patties ahead of time. I love these chicken wings. They're excellent. Just throw them in the oven on a busy night. back from Trader Joe's and we got some things that are be perfect for the carnivore diet. So I got some wild cod and I got some New Zealand grass-fed beef and I got some Argentinian red wild shrimp. Also these Carol's pastured eggs. I got two of those. I got these chomps beef sticks. I got the turkey because I'm making a recipe on Instagram. And if you don't follow me on Instagram, make sure and do that at grassfed girl. And I got the beef and the turkey for that. And then I got some New Zealand grass-fed butter and regular conventional ground beef, 80-20. Gotta have my fat. I got some roast beef. This is good if you're on the go. I got this sheep cheese. It's raw sheep cheese. So I thought that might be fun on some kind of maybe Italian inspired dish. I got this for my husband, mozzarella. He loves this with tomatoes in the summertime. These egg whites you can make, the protein's very modified fast bread that everyone likes to make. And I might make it for a video. So tell me if you want me to make that into a video down below in the comments. And then I got the, albu this is not albacore. Don't get the albacore because it has more mercury. Get the chunk light and make sure it's in water so you don't get any weird bad oils. So just get the alba <laughs> the chunk light in the water and it's also cheaper, great. I got two sea salts, never have enough sea salt. Then I got sparkly water. This is the watermelon lemonade and then the blueberry lemonade. I just love the flavor of this in the summer. The sparkling bubbles helps me out because it's so hot here. And I also got this mustard. I love mustard. That's one thing I kind of let slide on a carnivore diet is mustard. So that's what I got today at Trader Joe's. I hope that's helpful. Make sure to get my carnivore diet ebook that has 26 recipes, two meal plans, and lots of helpful hints on how to do the carnivore diet in real life.